good morning, even though it's good evening, because we just finished the benediction. It is um, Friday, and then I'm recording today because tomorrow is going to be a busy day. Tomorrow we have all the regular eating mass, and tomorrow, as you know, we have two of our brothers that are going to be ordained along with six of their classmates. They're going to be ordained deacons. So don't forget to tune up to the link so that you can be participating in that mass from your homes. <laughs> the description is going to be in the Facebook page and the St. Mark's website. Let's begin our meditation in day 23, already day 23, May the 23rd. She has set her table. She has sent out her maids to invite to the tower. Let whoever is a little one come to me. This is in the book of Proverbs, chapter 9, verses 2 to 4. Now we are going to hear what St. Louis Grignon de Montfort has to say. To us. Nowhere do we find Jesus nearer to us and more adapted to our weakness than in Mary, since it was for that reason that he came and dwelt in her. Everywhere else he is the bread of the strong, the bread of the angels, but in Mary he is the bread of children. What a beautiful quote from St. Louis Grignon de Montfort. She is so special because it's a place for us, her children. I like to refer coming to Mary uh, as her children, as coming to the school of Mary, because we all need to go through that school. It's the best school ever. She's the best teacher ever. She's the beautiful mother, willing to teach us with so much patience. Think of the best teacher in your life. It's nothing compared to her. She's a beautiful teacher, patient, loving teacher. And she's teaching us so many things in this month of May, especially how to love her son with an undivided heart. Let us pray. O oh Mary, you bring Jesus to us in a way we can understand. Let me come to know Jesus more deeply, love him more dearly, and follow him more closely. And may the Lord bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. See you tomorrow.